But um, yeah, so bad. Turn down for what? Did your mum think you was off school yesterday? Yeah. What did you do then? You had an extra day off, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, we just sat on his Xbox. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this. Fortnite. Oh, this, <laughs> So Jack was off yesterday, as I said before. His mum thought he was he was still off school when he was in school. So I'm going to nip him back home now, and then we're going to go back home and see what Sarah's been up to with the girls and see how John's getting on with the floor. So we just got back home now with the kids, and to my disgust, the builder, John, his van was gone, so I thought, oh, he's probably just nipped out to get more stuff. No. Do you see all this here? This is all his stuff that he's left. Because he's now gone home for the day, and he's coming back tomorrow, and he reckons it's going to take three days, so the downstairs now looks absolutely hanging. It stinks. It smells like rotten wood and mushrooms mixed together, like mould. So I'm not looking forward to, to spending the night down there tonight because it's already cold as it is. But now there's like gaps that big on the skirting boards, so it's it's even worse. So there's like one, two, three, four, five, there's six packets of tiles, two packets of adhesive and grout. So I'll show you anyway. We'll we'll go and see the downstairs in a minute. So I've just done Imogen's hair, put your head back down, model it, model your hair, give us a twirl, give your head a twirl. So I will be doing a tutorial for this for the Beautilicious page, but I just thought I'd show you it finished. And you've got yours done, haven't you? Is that a rainbow Mine's better. You've got a rainbow in. Mine's you had yours better. done earlier, so it's a bit Mine's messy now, isn't it? Mine's better. Mine's good. Mine's better. Mine's good. Mine's better. Mine's good. Mine's better. So I've just had a bath. Sorry for my ears poking out. I'm just about to put a face mask on me. Um, look what I've got on my feet. Look at my eye, though. I poked myself in the eye when I was going to the bathroom at work. And it's literally, I don't even know how I managed to do it, like, my hair was up, and as I've gone to put my, my hair back out my face, I've gone like this with my eye, I literally I've fallen, poked myself with the eye, because I've got my eyeball, and then it probably went red straight away. But look what I've got on my feet, it's a foot mask. It's so nice, like, when I put it on, it was like dead cold, but it's this. And it all cost me like 95p of, um, what's that shot called, um, body care. I thought it cost me. But Imogen's about to put this face mask on me. Let's show them. This one. This is my favourite. Me and Imogen had some of it the other day. And it proper made my face sting like I knew it was working. So, it's my favourite. Just gonna put face mask on. Why is it cold? Oh, I wish you didn't put them in that, in the water. Over the, everything's dead cold. But to be honest, I've just come out of the shower. Oh, that actually feels so nice. Better when you've got somebody else doing it. Maybe yeah, because it's just a brush and you've never used it. Just don't get it near my hair. Okay. Just get do like an outline. Oh. It hurts though, like at the beginning, like when it starts stinging. And then, oh, oh it's stinging now. Ah! I like doing it for my pores are closed up. I normally wash my face. We've started splashing my face with cold water so it closes all my pores. But I didn't want to do it so it so I just got into my pores and probably made them sting. No, like I had that. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> no, like I had that thing done to my face on Saturday. Mm. I don't feel like it's done anything. Like she scrapes my face and it like takes all the dead skin off your face. 
there's still a load of shit on my face. Oh, sorry for swearing. But there actually is, like, it's ridiculous how much is still on my face. Like, I was, like, just, like, I just, like, when I was putting my hair back before when I was in work, I went like that, I, like, across my head, just skimmed it, and, like, my nail, like, caught on, like, a piece of dead skin on my face. And, like, like, like when it's dead deep in your face. Yeah. And I proper got it out, like, it was dead thick, and I was just like, she's not even done a good job. Like, I paid 60 pounds, good job, I didn't pay 90 for it. But, like... I won't be going there again for it. Like, I don't even care where I'll go if it's more expensive. At least I know it'll work. But, to be honest, I think it's just because I've never had it done before. Obviously, it's not going to get literally all of it. Because there's lazy and lazy and lazy and lazy crap in my face. But, um, yeah. So bad. Oh, uh, my face. Always hurts on your nose worse, doesn't it? Oh, uh, nose, my cheeks are, uh, always hurt more. But I've got really I bad dry skin on my I've got really bad dry skin on my cheeks. Do you want another layer of that as well? Yeah, but not too thick. Just do it a little bit. I like it more on my head where there's more, like, crap on my head. Oh, my God. I love it when it stings and then like when it stops. And it, I, I leave it for, like, 25 minutes. Even though you meant to leave it for like 15 and wash it off, but I mean, I let it go rock hard and then wash it off. That's what I did last time. The Porsche. It felt well better though. Letting it go rock hard. Oh, it feels so nice. Oh, it feels so nice. I feel like I'm having makeup done. <laughs> yeah, you'd never get it done by me. I'm not that close to good yet. Oh, it feels very nice. Should you put the rest on? We're just going to put the rest on because it just feels a bit weird. Like saving it. I just think it's going to go rock hard. But because you've already squished it all the way to the top, you can't like squish it back down, so it just gets messy. Do you want to put it on for you and you vlog your face? <laughs> you vlog my face, yeah, it's really long. <laughs> Right, you hold the camera. Oh, it's, good. it's a good job I put plats. I got plats in. And you had a shower today, haven't you? Yeah, I had. So well. it should still like sting in your face. It's all right. That I think that time that you gave it me, I didn't have a shower that day. I don't know. Did I? Cause you look like together. So I'll just, uh, I can just go straight across like that, doesn't it? I'm getting it a bit in your nose, just mm -hmm. so, mm -hmm. like it gets everywhere. Oh my god, that was so cold. Mm -hmm. And they always like hurt like getting it on for like the first bit and then. Yeah, but you put a lot on, didn't you? I like more on my nose and more on my forehead. Just because of like they're like where like my spots mainly go. Yeah. Well, it, they don't go my nose. It's just because I get loads of blackheads and my pores are real bad in my nose. Do you know I hate it when Charles does this? <laughs> what I just did that noise. Oh yeah, you know what I hate. I hate your hairline. You've got like dead like baby bits up from. You know when people are always opening crisp packets on the bus. Oh, oh my god! I'm just like. Oh, and then like. I would never minutes, do that to you. And then like ten minutes later, the smell of them hits you. Or oh, turn your head around. Like this. There's this girl who gets my bus in the morning. She goes to school, couple, of, and um, she always has roast chicken crisp. So as soon as she opens them and you know it's her because it's her every single day with the same crisp and like as soon as she opens them literally like, the smell literally hovers the whole of the bottle literally it's disgusting I'm sat there and I'm just like trying to hold my breath in and like every time someone gets on the bus I like sit at the front of the bus just so when the bus doors open I'll go <laughs> get <the> nice <most laughs> breath in and like but literally like, I like roast chicken crisp but like you've got to be in the mood for roast chicken because they're not really the best flavour. But oh my god, when you oh, I keep saying sorry. 
but like um, when she opens it, I'm just like, <sighs> she's always scranning when they get on the bus, and I'm just like, give us some food and pull. So Give us some food. Have you seen your jaw down there? Oh, I know, but that's chocolate in it. I like, I like crisp more than anything. Oh, I like sweet. Like, I am, I am more of a chocolate person than a sweet person. Well, more of a dying person, aren't you? I, I love my chocolate. Like, I don't like beer about it, but I would be about chocolate, man. Be a bit lost. You're enjoying that? Mmm. It's good, man. <laughs> so good. I'll try not to lick my lips. Have you heard Freaky Friday by Chris Brown? Yeah. Mate. Well, it's it's mm. bought, I don't like it, mate. Mate, can't stop listening to it. Literally, I'm walking to work and I'm just like, yes, and it's going the night out. So With Kendall Jenner. What even is that part of the song? It's a, it's about um, I'm not gonna say it, but you you already know what it's about. A vagina. Yeah. It's it's like the worst bit of a, of the song ever. Like, why would you even put that? It's such a good song. I I can learn the inner workings of a woman. Might roll in the remix of that song literally because I will not have to listen to that part anymore. Like every time it comes on, like I always stop the song like before it comes on. I'm just gonna like push it out that way so. And put it a bit higher. Might get in a little bit tipsy, you know, but it's just like that. It's not quite funny. I feel like, oh my god, this is gonna sting more than yours does. Mm hmm. Ah. Uh. Mmm. Feels good. Right. Oh, we all face masks, don't we? Mm. Like when I ran out the other day, I was like, What have I got to do? Right. Do you want to see me then? I just fried. Go away! Because they wanted to know that. I was just gonna. Do oh, my phone's over there. I could follow that was my phone then. Oh, what are you gonna do for? I was gonna do a boomerang. Right, there's actually no need in that bit of the song, is there? Right, come on, and I know that, like, girls have got them, but come on. What the hell was that? Hello, guys. How are you today? <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> so me and Alka are just going to read his reading book, because, as you know, they are back in school. Thousand. In fact... We're not going to read right this second, we're going to come back in about two minutes when Alpha has actually gone and put some pyjamas on. See how quick that was? He's back and he's in his pyjamas. Woo! Superman! So, we're going to read this reading book now. And then he's going to go to Naughty Land. Oh, oh, yeah. I was going to say, can you read next? Yeah. What did you do in school today? Mm. What? You could not have forgot. Your first day back is always the best. You must remember. No. What did you have for dinner then? Well, it's not the Mash. first day back, it's the second day back, isn't it? Uh, pizza wrap. Pizza wrap? Yeah, you can get it's pizza like a wrap. wrap with like cheese and tomato in it. What tastes like a pizza? pizza. It does. Maybe we should make them. That's an idea. We might make them tomorrow. Get some wraps, make it like a pizza, and put them in the oven. You know what I want? I want that meat pie. Where I like, it's like a bread, then like the meat stuff inside oh. it. I tried that, it's only. The one that, that's the oven. I had it today. I see dinner ladies if they'll make one to bring home. It's yeah. awful. <laughs> It'll do our family. Yeah. It's awful. It's not amazing. It was... What did you have for pudding? Uh, ice cream. I didn't think you'd forget that. Yeah. So anyway, we're but gonna... I know what I've done. <coughs> Maths. Maths? Yeah. Did you do English? Mm, I know. Reading? Science. Yeah. Science? Yeah, science. IT? No, I don't Technology? Know. Don't know. Gardening? Don't, don't know what that is. Did you feed the ducks? No. 
Did you, you go ducks? to the farm? Yeah, we do have ducks. You do have and ducks? In the, uh, the in the farm? On our field and we've got chickens. <clears throat> and chickens. What else have you got in there? Rabbits. We've got rabbits. Flowers. Turtle. Turtle. Our tartars because we don't live in the water. A tartars. Where is a the turtle there? Tartars. What's tartars? Oh, peanuts in here. Peanuts! You'll be with him this year. You'll see him this year. You'll see him this year. Right, so we're going to read now, aren't we? Uh, yeah. Yeah? Come and see my toys, said Kipper. Come and see my room, said Bear. Later. Come and play, said Chip. Gran played with the children. A few moments later. They, own, they played inside. Oh no, said Mum. They went outside and played football. Oh no, said Dad. More moments later. So Sarah's just finished reading with Alpha. Well, actually, she's finishing off reading with Alpha. So I'm going to read with Oscar now. He's nearly finished his book, Bad Dad. And then he's going to have to go on to something else. So I think what we'll do is we'll buy him another David Williams book because he likes reading them. Billionaire. So I think, um, which one? Billionaire. Mil Billionaire. Billionaire. The World's Worst Children. The World's Worst Children, which was actually the one that I picked when he went to the book fair. No. But he didn't want it. Yeah, it was. It was the one that was on the that, shelf. That was Grandpa's Greatest Yeah, he didn't have that one. Like, what is? Alright, okay then. Yeah. It wasn't. Yeah, you're still wrong though. Money on the back seat and sped off in the direction of the bank. It was well past midnight now and there was no one about. A little later. Oh, the headlight. A couple of months had passed since the robbery yet and the bank had been repaired. Much later. How are we going to break in? I said, I don't think we should blow it up again. Reply, bank. There's no point creating a million pounds with us damaged, but to have a million pounds back in our box, the vault. Much, much later. So I know Dave said earlier that he was going to show you the floor, the mess. It's doing me heading already. So, the builder came out today. Not that there was much point because he came out at about half eight, measured up, came back about half one and left at three o'clock. Now, surely it wouldn't have took him more than an hour to do the rest of what he needed to do here. But for some reason he seems to think this job is gonna take him three days. I could do it myself in about four hours. So I don't always get three days from. I'm just saying. <laughs> anyway, let me show you. So, this is the floor. Because all this, you can see here, is all damp. And all the way up there, and this will actually have to come out as well because look at the state of it. And the skirting board is going to need changing or a bigger one put in there because I will not be tolerating. I will not be putting up that gap, not a chance. And I refuse for him to move the skirting board down because that will mean that I've got to redecorate the wall and I'm not doing it. So he's going to go to B&Q or wherever he goes and he's going to get a bigger piece of skirting board. I can't remember what it was called. <laughs> so at the minute everything is just a mess. Although a washroom is a little bit tidier because Dave's not been in it and I've got managed to get through most of my washing and wash the dog's bed. But look at this, I've got to show you this, simply because I polished these shelves about two days ago. And this is how dusty this house is. And because it's in the basement, and there's this up here, for some reason, that's supposed to let the air in and soak up all the heat. That seems to like dusting. That's all it's there for, so look at this. You wouldn't think these sides have been cleaned for a whole month. That is disgusting. So you know what you're doing tomorrow with me? that because we're going to clean it all out portia has got so many things up here on oscar and alpha 
that these need sorting out and moving. In fact, these need making. She's got this sign set. I don't even know whether we've done any of this. There's a sign set. There's the ice cream maker, Mr. Froster. I don't even know what that is. I'm not moving it. That's another Mr. Froster. Pie face. I don't even know what this is. And whatever this is up here. I don't know. We've even got this crayon maker thing that needs to be binned actually because they don't play with it. And then this dangly phone thing. I don't even know whether she's done that. And then this just twist or this was just like a cheap one that I bought, but they still enjoy playing it. And then all Dave's Lego getting dusty. So the joys of this washing room. These doors, these doors here are out of the kitchen. They're the doors I've been asking Dave to put on for let me just think, maybe about twelve months. And they're still there. I'm still waiting for him to go and buy the brackets to put on it. So if it kills me, I'll go out and buy the brackets myself tomorrow. And you know what they say, if you want a job doing, do it yourself. So that's what it looks like. I'm going to do it because Dave won't and I keep forgetting there's a step there now. I'm nearly breaking my neck. So it's going to be dark up there now. Say it again, it's going to be dark up there now. So I'm going to cut the camera here and then I'll put it back on and get up there. See how quick that was. So I'm just gonna tidy around, get to some of the rubbish, put the pots in the dishwasher, put the rubbish bag outside. This is like the smallest kitchen in the world. If somebody wants to swap kitchens in there, feel free because I would glad like if you were tiny one and like I'll have your big one. Because this kitchen, you could not even swing a cat in it. It actually looks bigger than it is. But if I like stand with my arms out, there's not much room. So, Dave's just gone to run me a nice bath because he's a good husband. I'm sick to death of hearing these machines and I don't know what he's printing, but it's doing my head in. So if somebody wants to come and take them, they can have them. Because then they won't do my head in. No, actually, the room that I was just showing you, where it's all, um, thinking where the washer is and the dryer. Well, they actually said that that room's gonna be getting tiled too. So, as you can see, there's a sink in that room. So hopefully, when he does that, he's gonna take that sink out. Which will be better, because they can put them downstairs. Because, I can't, I'm sick of sitting in my living room and I cannot hear my television. Because of the noise. When I'm reading with the boys, that's all I hear down my ears. I snapped before because I turned around and said to him, I'm sick to death of not being able to hear myself think. And he agreed. So we are definitely going to get a new piece of siding for downstairs so the machines can go down there. And I'd just like to thank everyone for all the really good comments. Obviously, I'm, I'm nowhere near used to doing makeup tutorials yet and I don't really feel that like comfortable doing them because obviously most of the people you see doing um, makeup tutorials are dead young or you know just dead pretty so I just want to say thanks anyway because there were some really nice comments on there and there's a lot of love and support on that on that video so I've actually set up a beautilicious Instagram page the YouTube page should be done by the end of the week. I was going to do it today, but I didn't. So I might do it tomorrow and have that just sat there ready. I'm actually going to set my new camera up tomorrow with the lens that I want to be using and try and find a backdrop. I'm trying to think of a backdrop that what I use, but I can't quite make my mind up because I, I, I wanted something glittery or gold or even like um, a rose gold but I don't want something that's going to go out of focus where it, if it's shining the camera starts like trying to focus in on that so I don't know whether I just want something like a 
flower at the back of it. But whatever I pick, I will show you. Because I know the other night in one of the vlogs, I told you I was going to show you the tiles that I've been looking at for the bathroom and the walls. Um, and I didn't because I actually forgot, so I do apologise. So anyway, I'm going to go and get in the bath and I'm sure you will see Dave in about one second. Alright guys, that's going to be the end of today's vlog. I hope everybody's enjoyed it today. Got a double upload today, got two uploads. Now tomorrow's going to be a little bit different because we've actually got a nip out to Georgina's who does um, Botox and all that other crap because um, I actually manage... Oh, the cat, it looks like the cat's getting killed by the dog. Anyway, we're going to go to Georgina's tomorrow night to catch up with her because I haven't seen her for ages and neither Sarah. So we'll be out actually when we're doing the live when the live's due so i think we might nip to barbara and kevin's and do the live from there tomorrow night which is obviously going to be after this so you never know or we might leave it a little bit later and do it later on in the evening i don't know so you will know tomorrow at some point after this vlog so as you've seen downstairs the floor is horrendous hopefully it'll be better tomorrow we'll be able to show you that and with that said i'm going to end the vlog and say do not forget so smash the like button, subscribe if you're not already, make sure you leave a comment, make sure you click the bell, you'll get notified, as you did today if you had the notification bell on, like Sarah did the makeup um, tutorial, anything like that you'll get notified straight away, it's vitally important, especially if you want to keep up with the lives as well, because the lives are sporadic, we need to nail down a time, and we are going to get um, a capture card for the big camera and start doing it from that, so the quality of them is just like this, how you're seeing now, so, we will see you tomorrow because we do this every single day.